All right, good morning. Welcome back to TCMN Outdoors. Today we're gonna to do first ice part two, so stay tuned. So we're heading out to the lake. It's uh, Monday. It's about 10 a.m. So it's probably the worst possible time, but these are the cards I have. So we're gonna head out and try to see what we can find. Uh, probably gonna try to target Walla and Northern, but like I said, at this point, I just wanna catch something and get it on film. Ugh. So right now we're gonna go back out to the lake that we went to before. Um, I think it should be good. I kind of got it laid out um, and there should be more ice. So I'm definitely excited about that. I uh, got everything loaded up, lots of stuff. So with that, head down the road and um, get to the lake and I'll catch back up with it. beautiful out we don't have or there isn't anyone else here at the lake see behind me not sure the ice conditions yet uh, last week when I was here it was decent um, looks like it's frozen over now but um, I gotta definitely check it before I go out any deeper all right so we made it on the ice hit yeah, I just went a little slow because there's a lot of cracks that formed over the last week that I was here. But as you can see, that part behind me there, that was um, open water last week. So definitely making progress. Right now, like I said, I'm out here at the worst possible time. But, you know, it's, it's what I got to deal with. I gotta get out of here at about 2.30, so it leaves me about three, three and a half hours worth of fishing. So not ideal um, time of day, but it is overcast. Um, it is still early in the ice season. So I think I'll try to use that and see what I can wrestle up. I'm gonna go punch a bunch of holes and then I'll come back to you guys. I'm going to uh, just start hole hopping with a uh, um, jigging wrap and see if I can call anything in really. I mean, it's not bad out here today. I just, I don't know if I can get to the spots that I need to, but. Um, also, uh, So right now we're sitting at about, I'm on a, it goes from about eight foot to about 10 foot break. Eight foot's a little bit uh, mushy and then it breaks into sand. So um, I'm gonna try that. I switched out my tip up. I got that uh, switched up to a smaller hook, put a fat head on it. I don't think being midday like this, the sucker's gonna work too well, but we'll see. I'm uh, Go around and jig for a little bit and then I might uh, stop and set up the shack and I don't know.
Ouch. There it is. First fish on film. That means I'm in the right area for Mr. Walleye. Well, you can't tell me that was the only one laying there. All right, so it's been about been about an hour since I got out here. Um, jumped around, got one perch. That was really it so far. So right now I set up another tip up. Um, that one I got rigged up for a northern or hopefully a big walleye. But and now I'm going to go out and try to see if I can get some deeper water there behind me. So that's the plan right now. Hopefully I don't fall in. This is all open water. Alright, give you a little status update. Went out to um, where there was open water last week and checked the ice. There's about six inches of ice, but only about three inches of good ice. So um, I decided not to go out there. I mean, it held me fine, but. I'd just rather, you know, play it safe instead of going out there and on marginal ice when I know where I'm at now is good ice. So that's where I'm at right now. I uh, just kind of checked the tip ups, moving them around. Nothing real doing, not really marking anything as of yet. But we're out here, we're fishing, we're having fun. All right, so made it home. Um, wasn't the best day out on the water, but I kind of knew that going into it as I went there from 10 to 2 in the middle of the day. So I um, was able to get a small perch as well as mark a walleye, but um, couldn't convince them to come topside. So, you know, right now, um, still, a little, still a little early. Most of the spots I wanted to hit um, while I was able to walk out on them. There's still only about three inches of ice with um, another three inches of like not that good of ice on top of it. So I figured I'll give it about a week and uh, play it safe. But I mean, for the most part, the you know good solid eight inches where I was at, I would, I would think by next week, um, the rest of the lake should be good. But next week, I might try a different lake as well. So definitely... Um, happy to be out just uh wish i would have caught some more fish but thank you for watching this is tcmn outdoors and we'll see you next week